For two weeks, campus life has not looked the same at Cornell University. As over a thousand workers have been fighting for higher wages, now those demands have been met. Members at UAW Local 2300 voted to ratify their new contract, ending the strikes that started over two weeks ago. 12 News' Daniel Curran is on campus with more on this agreement and the return to normalcy. Daniel, what can you tell us? Yeah, that's right, Kevin and Autria. I'm standing in Hope Plaza, where students are enjoying the return to normalcy on campus after the conclusion of the UAW strikes last night. Now, UAW officials tell me this new contract has a lot for the union to be proud of. As you walked the Cornell University campus on Tuesday, no longer did you see the sight of protesting workers or hear the sound of cars honking in support. The UAW strikes came to an official end Monday night after the union voted to ratify a new contract with 77% approval. The new contract includes 21.4 to 25% wage increases over the next four years and cost of living allowances. UAW Region 9 Director Daniel Vicente says Cornell is the first university to include this cause in its contract with workers. So we believe that we've now set the new standard uh, that we are going to pursue in every higher education facility to where we represent employers or uh, members and uh, we hope that it spreads to the other labor unions as well. Vicente says senior workers sacrificed higher pay for those with shorter tenures. This was done as an effort to eliminate tiered pay. He says there were opposing voices and those voices deserve to be heard. We did hear from a lot of more senior members who felt that um, they were happy for the, the lower graded people, the more entry level people but they felt the wages weren't there for them, so they were voting no. But even, even when they were explaining to us why they were voting no, the reasons were very logical. Cornell students say they were happy to see the union vote in favor of a contract they were excited for. I think it was, it's great. I think that I wish that obviously more, a higher percentage of the union workers um, were happier, but I think that the majority rules, so I think that's much better. Back to work, back to where we're supposed to be. Students say as campus life returned to normal on Tuesday, they are happy to get back to regular dining and dorm maintenance. The past couple of weeks have definitely been an experience. Like my bathrooms have been really dirty and the food hasn't been great. But it's nice, this morning it was nice to go into the bathroom and have like all the toilet paper be stocked and stuff like that. Now Vicente tells 12 News that uh, because of the sacrifices that were made by the senior workers in this round of negotiation, they hope to reciprocate that respect in four years when they negotiate another contract. Live at Cornell, Daniel Curran, 12 News, Tompkins County.